Hi everybody, my name is Sunshine Selby and I'm a speech therapist at Sarah Dooley Center for Autism. So I just have a quick tip for an activity that you can do. Um, and this, all you would need for this is a ball, some tape, and a couple of markers or crayons or even a pen. So what you would do with this is you would put some tape on just various locations around the ball and you would write someone's name on there. It might be grandma, it might be an aunt, an uncle, a friend. And when you play ball, whenever your child catches it, the closest name to their thumb is gonna be the person that they contact. And they can contact them in a variety of ways, even with social distancing. They could write them an email if they're at the point where they're able to work on their typing and using a computer. They could call and talk to them on their phone, practicing just using their social skills. That can also be something that could be done over FaceTime. Or they could draw them a picture. We could say, okay, we're gonna draw a picture for grandma. What does grandma like? We can still make it a language rich environment, talking about the things that grandma would like. Maybe they wanna draw a picture of grandma. Maybe they wanna draw a flower for her. We're gonna be talking and kind of making it a fun activity where we're connecting with someone else in the family or a friend and still trying to keep those social skills up. This can be something that can be done in the house or we can take it outside and make it a little bit more active and come up with a list of people that we're gonna call for the week. Feel free to adapt any activity to how it best suits you and your child. Well, I hope you have fun with this one. I hope you have a ball, actually. <laughs> Thank you for listening and have a great day. Stay safe.